what's going on everybody welcome back to my channel it is your favorite auntie mo and we are back and just like the title says i am back with another milestone mukbang y'all i have 500 subscribers y'all just don't know y'all been rocking with a girl y'all been rocking with your girl and i appreciate that so damn much and so my little tradition that i'm doing is when i hit my milestones or whatever you know what i'm saying what else do black folks do when we celebrate something? We eat. So, you know what I'm saying? She here eating today. You know what I'm saying? Of course, I got, I'm doing another, sea, like B Love say, seafood boil. Um, I got my snow crabs. I got some corn. I got some sausage, red potatoes. And do you know my ass forgot the boiled eggs? Forgot the boiled eggs at the last damn minute, y'all. Um, First of all, I want to apologize if you hear some humming in the background. Um, that is my fan going on. I got this big ass industrial fan blowing on a bitch because um, <laughs> it's hot up in here. You know what I'm saying? We in Texas and uh, it's butt crack sweat hot about this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? And trying to make um, the, the mukbang and all of that. You know what I'm saying? First of all, let me apologize. I said I wasn't going to try to curse as much, but you know what I'm saying? A bitch try to do the best she can. Work with me now. Pray with me now. Um, but uh, I'm hungry, so let's go ahead and get into this. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the food that I'm about to receive. That it provide nourishment to my body and my mind. Thank you to everybody who has subscribed to my channel. Thank you to all of my subscribers, Lord. Bless their lives. Financially bless them. Anything that they are praying for, Lord, whatever they are going through right now, Lord God, I pray that you bless them. Bless them, bless them abundantly, Lord God. I thank you for this. Everything that we have, everything we still have yet to receive, I thank you in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Y'all, I'm so doggone hungry. I waited all damn day just to doggone cook so I can get into this. I've got my towels on deck, of course. I've got my water. And I've got my Modiva sauce. You know what I'm saying? It's like a little spin on the, the B-Love sauce. It ain't got all the spices in it. It got enough spices in it. But I like to add red wine. She likes to add beer to hers. I like to add red wine to mine's. I do, a, um, you know what I'm saying, a little bit more brown sugar. So mine's is a little bit sweeter. But I'm hungry as hell. So hold on. Let, let me get into this. Let me, like my dad used to say, let me taste it for you. Let me let you know what it tastes like. But you know, I don't want to be rude. I don't want to be rude. Let me give you the first little bite. Because this sausage is, man, this sausage is so the real. Mmm. It's this andouille pecan smoked pork venison type something you know what I'm saying it's, it's the bomb y'all mm, mm, mm. y'all don't even know man mm, mm, mm. Y'all, a bitch was hungry. I didn't say bitch, I said bitch. I'm working on it. Um, My son, let me tell, man. Hold on, let me eat a little bit first and I'm going to tell y'all how my son conned me. realize I forgot my scissors so pause hold on one second all right time in you know what let me go ahead and move this hair out the way because it's about to get real it's about to get real up in this chick how's everybody doing today I hope everybody's day has been going well hope everybody's weekday and weekend and whatever else whenever this airs has been going good well, um let me tell y'all how my son calmed my ass today well he really he really didn't con me but he did con me but he didn't con me So, last night, no, I take that back. Yesterday, he woke up. He wasn't feeling all that well. I'm just thinking maybe it's his allergies or something like that, right? But he said he had a headache. So, I gave him some medicine. 
sent them on to camp. Life is good, right? Come home from work yesterday because my husband picked him up from camp. My husband said he had been sick the whole time they had got home from camp, right? So I'm thinking, oh, hell, my poor baby. Maybe his allergies really is messing with him. Because at first, I ain't gonna lie, I thought he was just fucking with me because he didn't want to go to camp. So I thought he was just messing with me, right? So I'm like, oh, boo-hoo, my poor baby. So I gave him some medicine, let him lay down or whatever, right? Well, when he woke up from his nap, again, at like 10, well, about 8, 9 something, he was burning up, y'all. Burning up. Hot as I don't know what. So, of course, you know what I'm saying? That's my baby. I'm starting to freak out and shit, right? Damn. This shit ain't coming apart right the way I wanted to, but it's still good as hell. So, I'm like, oh, hell, my baby. So, I give him some more medicine, let him go to sleep. About three-something this morning, he come creeping up in my bed, burning up again. So, I'm like, oh, hell no. I ain't going to work. I need to stay home with him. But then again, I'm like, well, let me just play it and see how I do. Because my son, he's a resilient damn kid. He really don't get sick at all. So, and most of the time when he does get sick, he bounces back real quick. It ain't nothing. The motherfucker is, like, incredible. So, we wake up at our normal time this morning. Well, actually, he woke me up a little bit earlier. And so, I'm like, uh, baby, you feel okay? Because he didn't have a temperature quite. It wasn't that high. It was like, it was a low grade, 99, 99.6. Let's so say, you feeling okay? You you want mom to stay home with you? Or, you know, you want to go to camp? Or what you want to do? Because he was like, uh, first he was saying he feels good, but then he was like, mm, but then when I said, do you want mom to stay home with you? Or do you want to go to camp? That's all he heard, mom to stay home with me. So he was like, yeah, um, I think I'm pretty sick, mom. I think you need to stay home with me. Ooh y'all the goodness of this that was good so I'm like alright let me stay home with him or whatever so give him some medicine we go back to sleep my husband goes on to work cause you know he starts his new job whatever right he goes on to work I fall back to sleep I wake up I hear his this fool laying next to me cracking up laughing like he watching Def Comedy Jam or something. I'm like, what in the heck is you in here? So I wake up. He laying on the side of bed, uh, laying next to me. So I'm like, what is you up here laughing at? He's sitting up here watching Goosebumps, watching TV like it ain't nothing. He ain't now nothing more bit, bit of sick. Just sitting up there chilling. So I'm like, well, what in the hell? Boy, I thought you was sick. You was so doggone sick. You needed me to stay home with you, all of that. So you mean to tell me like life is good? Everything is good? He's like, well... Um, I am feeling good, but I am feeling a little sick now that you say I'm like this little nigga played me, played me out my money, y'all, made me miss work. All because he wanted to have a snow day of of staying home and not doing nothing. So I'm like, little Negro, you just played me. You played me, you played your mama boy. But then again, I ain't gonna lie, I just checked the temperature temperature a few minutes ago. It was about uh 100, 100, yeah, 100.0. So he does got a little something, a little virus or something. Luckily, if I'm working in the medical field, you know, we keeping it down and all of that. But it could be his, be his allergies. I'm hoping it's just his allergies. I don't know. Oh, y'all want some of this side shit? Some of this side shit? Man, I hate I forgot my egg. My egg would have set this sucker off. It's all good though. Y'all, but for real though, 500 subscribers. Let me tell you, it ain't been easy trying to get this, this channel together. It is very hard creating and um, sustaining and, and, and making sure you are constant with your YouTube channel. This by far has one of, been one of, one of the hardest things I've done. Not the most, but one of the hardest things I've done.
but I'm very grateful for all the positive feedback that I've been getting from people. Mmm. -hmm. Look at the goodness. And I'm grateful for the little bit of um, negative feedback. Although I really only got really one bad thing that was said back to me. I don't doubt more to still to come. Um, but overall, it's been super fun. I really enjoy doing it. I have a lot of fun making these videos, especially when I make videos like this. Where I really don't have nothing planned but to eat. Unlike doing the review videos where I have to sit and I have to watch a, watch a show, take notes while I'm watching it. Sometimes depending on the show, gotta watch, go back and watch it a second time just in case I didn't miss nothing. But um, it's been so fun. And yeah, I'm just grateful for it. I'm not gonna lie y'all. This is the second, ooh, have mercy Lord. This is the second time I actually shot this little 500 milestone video. Cause the first time I shot, I actually had some king crabs though. Man, the king crab legs that I had were off the rip. So doggone good. But the video just did not turn out right <laughs> at all the way I wanted it to. The food was, was amazing, but yeah. The lighting wasn't right and um, I actually shot it in like this new little setup or whatever that I'm trying to do because I want to do bring more mukbangs to my channel. I went out and bought a ring light, Ew, you know what I'm saying? I can say I'm an official YouTuber now. Bitch, I got a ring light. What's up? Yep, I YouTube. I'm a YouTuber. Uh-huh, show sure is. I got a ring light, bitch. Anyways, but um, yeah, I went out and got a ring light. Got a little some some I'm trying to do with a background still, you know, working up on that. But 500 was coming up and I wanted to get something going. So I just, you know what I'm saying? Made it do what it do. Ooh. The haters on my body shaking my mouth. But, um, yeah, that first video I made like this, it just did not turn out right at all. <laughs> it was a mess. It was a mess mainly because I had too much wine. And, um, y'all need to see me like that. Mm -mm. Y'all need to even see me like that. Nope, nope, it ain't gonna even happen. It ain't gonna even happen. This damn sausage is good. I'm gonna put down in the description box below the ingredients that I use um, for my sauce. And I don't wanna say it's my sauce, it's just a spin on the sauce that everybody pretty much does. Some ingredients I do use mostly, some I don't. Because um, a bitch like me got intestinal issues and uh, I can't have nothing too spicy. So you know what I'm saying, I gotta wash it with all of that. I want some of these potatoes to get into it. Ooh, that was good. Mm-mm. But um mm. shout out to my baby sister. Cause she's gonna kick my ass when she see this video. Cause um she was already disappointed that uh, she didn't get in on the king crab, uh, king crab video that I made. That that video flop. So when she see this, she really gonna be mad. But I love you, girl. I take care of you.
got these crab legs is off the chain. Mm. I ain't gonna lie, I'm getting way better at these uh, crab oils than I used to be. At first, I didn't know what the hell I was doing with it. It tasted good, but it wasn't like bam. Now it's like bing, bing, bam. The only part I think I really got to get used to is not really eating on camera, but um, yeah, eating on camera. I ain't gonna lie. Because um, at first I just used to watch mukbangs. I wasn't really into them because I thought they were kind of weird. But man, I stumbled across B-Love's uh, life. And that was a wrap right there. That was a wrap. And she actually helped me to feel more confident to just go out and just to just start my channel. And not necessarily sit back and wait on somebody to... Well, not even really wait on somebody to stop being afraid to just actually do it. See somebody who older than me. I'm not saying nothing against her, nothing like that. That is not at all what I'm saying. But just to see somebody who's doing it doing what they love and they enjoy doing shit that was enough inspiration for me right there to just say to hell with it i'm gonna do my channel you don't like it you ain't gotta look at it and obviously if you're looking at it you're talking shit to something about it you like that's all i'm gonna say about that but um hmm Really, I want to sit and hold a conversation, but this is so good. I ain't ate shit all day. Man. I wish it had taste o vision through the screen so y'all could taste this. It's just succulent, goddammit. Um, hopefully y'all will be tuning in with me because Power is getting ready to start and I will be doing the review on Power. They say this is a big breakdown. Legal or illegal, baby. I gotta fake it. Yes, I will be reviewing that, so hopefully you will be in tune with a bitch for that. You know what I might do? I might do a mukbang review at the same time. I don't know, because it'd be a lot going on with that episode, and then um, try to keep notes on top of that and eat, depending on what it is I'm eating. I don't know, but I know I'm ready for the new season to start. I know I'm going to be here for it. You know, your auntie gonna have the review for you, baby. Ew, ew. Y'all wanna bite? I'm really hungry. If you hungry like me, hey, I'll get you some. I want a little shot, shot. Ew, okay. I'm actually getting kind of full, y'all. I'm trying to eat slow. But man, when I tell you I was so doggone hungry. Like I said, my son conned me, man. He conned me. So, as soon as he woke up, he hungry. He want to do this. He want to do that. So, I had to get up with him. Reading for a little while and all of that. Speaking of the devil. Here we go. Discus, disco. That goes in the sink, Papa. Thanks, Mom. 
In the sink. Y'all kids be full of shit. Kids be full of shit. He just wanna come up in here, be nose to see what it is I'm doing, see how much more food I got left. He knows it. Alright. Cause a little food can have the rest of this. I'm actually kinda full. But man, I done already started with this crab legs. So I'm gonna have to get into it. Um I did want to talk a little bit more about how you can like help to well not even really help how you what stuff that I did to kind of help grow my channel. Twitter has been my dog on rock. When I tell you Twitter has helped me out so much with helping to grow my channel and to just get out there and engage with different people, meet different people that can actually help me to grow my channel. I didn't know that there was like different like Facebook groups and different stuff like that that you can like mingle with other people and like talk with them about what help, you know, what did they do to help grow their channel and different things that you can do. So it ain't been easy at all, y'all. But it has definitely been worth it. I've had I've had people approach me with different things. Some things that really ain't for me but um <laughs> some opportunities that um i thought maybe would work but mm, didn't actually kind of work but nothing bad nothing bad nothing bad nothing bad but it's just been taken off and what i really want to do if not, i'm going to be completely honest with you um a girl need a check you know what i'm saying she need another check I, bad, I got bad knees, and um, I'm over 30, so I can't go to the strip club. You know what I'm saying? Um, this lottery thing, you know what I'm saying? It, it, it ain't working. It ain't hitting. But um, I'm being stupid, but for real, though, I enjoy doing this. I do look for the perks that come with having a YouTube channel. I am. I ain't even gonna lie about that. And I just wanna thank everybody that's been rocking with me so far. Like, everybody that leaves comments. I've already got some, some ride or die, some loyal people. Every time I post something, you liking it, you commenting on it. Thank you for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because if you're my ride or die, my loyal, you watching this right now. Thank you so much, and I appreciate you for that. You just don't know how much you... you you inspire me to keep on doing what I'm doing. And man, I just I just thank y'all so much. Thank y'all for rocking with you, girl. As long as you rocking with me, I will keep on providing the best content to you that I can. Um Yeah. So um I'm gonna eat this little last piece of sausage here. I'm trying to get some of the good stuff on it right here, right here. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to let the boy take over this because I'm so full. Mm. But I can eat one more potato though. Yeah, it's the sauce that set it off. I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm gonna put down in the description box what I did to my sauce, cause my sauce is the bomb. Mm, mm, mm. Y'all, again, thank you for rocking with your girl. Thank you to 500 subscribers. Thank you to 500 more and 500 more and 500 more. Everybody that's been hanging with me, rocking with me, I appreciate you. God bless you. And um, keep on letting me know 
what I can do to entertain you guys. <laughs> Cause I'm here. I'm I'm here. Bitch, I'm here. I'm here. And y'all fucking with the girl. And I appreciate you so much for that. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Cheers to 500 subscribers, y'all. Thank y'all so much. I am so blessed, and I appreciate you guys. And I will see y'all in the next video. Peace out. Cheers. What's up, y'all? Do me a favor and share the video. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel. Let me know what you think and um, hit that notification button so you will be up to date when I upload my latest videos. I holla.